In this Shade Light short, I'm going to talk about bump settings in Shade Light for SketchUp. When you apply a material in SketchUp, as you may have seen, we apply an automatic bump to a lot of the materials. So this wooden decking here, we've applied a texture to it automatically. Now if you apply a flat colour in SketchUp, this renders in Shade Light just as a flat colour. So we can adjust this bump setting, and if I change this to 2 in the Shade Light Material Editor, we then apply a bump map to this. And this is a random pattern so that it looks like it's a, a painted finish. Now we can take this further if I use a texture image, and I've downloaded this texture image from cgtextures.com. And I can apply this texture image, and I'm just going to change the scale. And we can start to see as Shade Light refines that we are getting a bump effect on this brick pattern. Now I can increase this effect, so I'm going to up this to 6 in the uh, Shade Light Material Editor. And we can see now we've got a lot more prominent bump applied to our feature here. Now this is coming from the difference between the dark and the light of this brick texture here. Now the value can be plus or minus depending on the uh, the colour map that you have of your texture. And this goes up to 9 in both directions. 